Okay guys, it's the end of July, first part of August. You know what that means in the southeast. That means army worms. Ants, oh look, see out there in the street? A little bird picking up worms already. So I got some, I've noticed some birds on this edge of my property coming in, eating worms. So they're marching towards me. And as you know, that's why they're called army worms. So they start one in the yard and they just march straight across. And we definitely don't want that to happen to this green Bermuda grass. So we're going to put down a couple of products to help treat that. Also seen a, a mole tunnel right there at the edge of my property coming towards me. So we want to stop that by eliminating any grubs, army worms, or other bugs that might be in the yard to feed them. So they come in, they see no food, and then maybe they'll turn around and head back to the woods. So there's plenty to eat down there. All right, let's head to the garage and I will show you exactly what I'm going to put down. Hey guys, welcome to Sunny Bermuda. Today I'm going to put down some Duo Side by the Andersons. This is a 40 pound bag and also some Bug Be Gone. And what's cool about these products, they're both the same active ingredient. I'll show you here. By Fenthrin here, it's 0.058%. And then on the Bug Be Gone, we're looking at 0.2%. So almost, what, quadruple? The amount of uh, active ingredient in the bug be gone. So why did I get duo side? I got duo side mainly for my front and backyard areas. I got about 8,000 square feet that I real mow and I want to put it down and I want it to quickly disperse. And this is using the dispersing granule technology. I picked this 40 pound bag up from Ewing's Irrigation for, what was it, $45. They also sell this on Amazon. I believe it's 35 for an 18 pound bag. So make sure you check your local urine's irrigation or you know local ag, ag farm. See if you can get that at a good price. And then this, of course, is available anywhere at Home Depot or Lowe's at the big box stores. And this will cover, let's see, where was it? 30, yeah, here you go, 33,000 square feet. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna put this at one pound per thousand. Let's see, let's turn it over. And read your instructions, here we go, on lawns. It says apply 0 0.6 to 1.2 pounds over a thousand square feet. So I'm just gonna put one pound, make it easy. And then this, I'm gonna put down the whole bag over 8,000 square feet. We'll turn this over. Well, not eight pounds, but 8,000 square feet. And the settings here is going to be between a, a medium rate and a high rate. The medium rate, this 40 pounds will cover 10,000 square feet. And I'm putting it on 8,000 square feet. So but in between the medium high rate. So I'm just gonna spread it evenly, those two areas, and then the rest of the yard, I'm gonna just run around and put this down at a thousand, one pound per a thousand square feet. So let's load this up in the hopper and get spread. And we're gonna do the first, we're gonna do the front yard first with the duo side. We're, we are expecting rain the next two days. So I just gotta mow in, but hopefully this will get watered in and the dispersible granules will, will work as advertised as it does, usually does, at least it has in the past. I'm going to load this up in my hopper and start spreading it. Right, I wanted to point out how small the pill size is in this, the duo side. Right here is this at 150. That's so really small. I would pick it up and total it up, but I don't have my gloves on, so I'm just gonna show you. It's really small. If you've ever used the ZZX, it's really small as well. So it's, it should spread really good and really fast in this big hopper, so I'll make sure I'll turn it down. I put it on 11, which is the recommended for the duo side here for the for the Lesco spreader. Yeah, Lesco, well it says 12. Let me see what I put it on. Yeah, actually I put it on 13. Yeah, I put it on 13, which is a little above the 12. So it should go down really good. Just wanna let you guys see that. Okay guys, I got a really good coverage. Got about 15 pounds left in the hopper. 
what I did is I started off by going, I did a circle and I kept going around and around until I went down the middle. And then I started down the end and I went back and forth like this. That way you get good, even coverage on your turf. And also I didn't worry about my putting down my edge guard here because I don't care if it gets in the flower beds because it kills uh, spiders, uh, ticks, and other animals, other, I mean, other insects. So I'm not, I don't care about that, but I will take my blower and I'll blow all this off. I'll probably blow it into the flower bed <clears throat> to help prevent, you know, bugs and stuff from getting in the pine straw and in, in into the house. Okay guys, I got one last little product I'm gonna show you. This is the Spectricide Mound Destroyer. It's granules, it kills fire ant beds. And in fact, this is the first time I've had to use it this year. I've really been happy with the lack of fire ants in my yard, but I do have a couple in the front yard. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this on it, even though I did put down the duo side and the bugs be gone. Just, just added safety to make sure I get rid of these giant ant beds. And what it looks like is almost a powder formula. And you sprinkle a cup of this per mound and then water it in. Alright guys, this is pretty simple. You just basically take your Spectricide Mound Destroyer and sprinkle it on the ant bed. This one's kind of small. I put maybe three-fourths of a cup on it and sprinkle around the edges. Okay. You don't want to disturb the mound and then you take this and water it in. It basically collapses it when you water it in and it washes the poison down in there. Make sure you get that clean down in the center of the mound. That's it. And that little dead Bermuda spot should recover well. And also if you notice this, this here is Bahia. And I just sprayed it the other day, yesterday. And it will be in the upcoming video. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm not gonna show you putting out the bug be gone and also the duo side on the backyard. Basically the same process, just go over your yard. Make sure you get an even coat down. It is getting late, so I'm just gonna go ahead and throw that down real fast. But hope you enjoyed this video, learned a little something, learned a little about the three products I showed today. If you did enjoy it, make sure you give me a, leave me a comment. I'll reply to your comments and also give me a like. And if you're not a subscriber, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And we will see you in future videos as we work in the lawn. You guys have a great day.